You are my most trusted soldiers. We can't defeat the enemy alone. We'll need the help of old friends and old enemies. We can't win through force of arms. Deception, stealth, and misdirection will help us stay alive. We will use any means necessary to defeat this enemy. Always remember, victory is life. Hello, humans and non-humans alike, and good ever applies to you. It's today we're back on Star Trek Online Dominion Let's Play, where we're going to investigate this secret Dominion facility, which holds a lot of Fakiri. Really worked hard on this one, huh? I mean, shit, lady. People, you know, no, this lady. This is that one founder's doing. Well, that answers everyone one else question. died. These are medical stasis pods. Judging by what we heard upstairs, the occupants are. Thank you. It gets worse. I'm picking up life signs ahead. I'll bet some of the stasis pods down here have opened. The Dominion made the Fakiri to kill Klingons. I'm not expecting a warm welcome. It would be a good day to die for them. Worf and Martok need to see this. No, 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 do not show this to War for Martok. Come on, we want to have this fucking alliance work. We don't need to go to war with the fucking Federation and Klingons, too, and the Herc. You know what just occurred to me? If we took the material, if, the okay, the mo original mushroom material that I mentioned was what created these fucking, uh, Herc. And then we use that material to also, uh, or removing it is what we use to create the Herc. And then we also, that became the basis for Ketracel White. Why don't we just throw Ketracel at them? Give me a fucking grenade that spreads the Ketracel around. That'll probably fix this. I'm picking up traces of Ketracel White in these tanks. The Dominion probably manufactured it here to keep the Fakiri in line and took it with them when they left the facility. So, we have a station full of angry Fakiri with no way to pacify them. I have like a hundred vials of fucking Ketracel White. Can't I just start throwing this shit? Come on! Oh, there is an anomaly. And we missed it? Where? Wait, in here? There's nothing in here. So well, that door's locked, so I have no idea what the fuck I'm supposed to do with that. We've got company, and they don't look friendly. Hello, Fakiri. We are your replacements, motherfuckers. And we fight a lot better than you. But seriously, fucking gold plus that Oh, if I had known that. Oh, uh, that's what I get for not checking the active more Enemy often. Wait, is there? Okay, there's a hordling there. There we go, that killed it. Oh, this fire ability is very <sighs> useful. <sighs> We're lucky there were only a few of them. I don't want to be around if all of these Fakiri wake up. Let's see if we can find some way to... Keep the rest of these pods from opening. Shit, I could take on all the Fakiri in here. Bring it on, people. Come on. I got my pole arm. I'll kill you all. And if you make me, I'll pull out my Kayla's shard sword. Or shard batlass. 
Oh wait, shit, I need my catch yourself. I need my catch yourself. <laughs> ah, the addiction. Enemy targets on There's not even really addiction anymore, it's a necessity for life. You were made around the white. Well, at least we don't have to snort the shit. We just have a tube permanently implanted in our necks to make to put it into us. <laughs> because that's much better, right? <laughs> ah! Oh come on. If they didn't want me to make cocaine jokes, they should not have named it the they should not have had white in the name. They should just call it Catch a Cell. It's like, just, just naming it Catch a Cell White is asking for people to make the cocaine jokes. By the Prophets. Uh, the Prophets had nothing to do with this shit. That's for certain. More incoming. We need an exit. Fast. Yeah, let's just blow up the- just shoot at the damn pods while they're in stasis. They can't be that durable. I mean, seriously. Odo Takira, we're on our way to assist you. It'd be greatly appreciated. Not! I can kill these guys with one hand behind my- tied behind my back. Bakiri aren't so tough. Klingons just over exaggerate about this shit. Die. Narice, Hello, Rabbit. Are you? Damn. I'll manage. Let's get out of here while we can. Oh shit! Get him up! Get him up! Get him up! Victory is life. So is Rock to Gino, but I don't say it every five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> That's Star Trek coffee. Just, just Star Trek coffee. Coffee is life! Oh my god, I can see people just running around saying that now. Coffee is life! Coffee! So you don't even have to be a Star Trek fan. I think. Oh, fuck. Fucking hell. Well, I'm not gonna start the entire mission over just to read one line of dialogue, so get your asses moving. Looks like the Herc followed us down here. I I could uh, fight the bugs. The bugs are a lot more dangerous. Send help. I know what they want in here. Wait, does that mean we're part insectoid? But we have babies. I, I thought we were mammals. I'm pretty sure Jemadar are mammals. Damn, the thing on his arm looks cool though. I really wish to become a, like a playable species. I know th this Star Trek people, th it's never gonna happen, but... Uh, man can dream. Very impossible dream. Okay, I guess I sense of precision, don't know what that actually does. Keep moving, we're almost there. Odo! Odo, look out! Oh, wait. Wait, he's green. Oh my god, he's not trying to kill us. The white works! Hold your fire. I think it's trying to communicate. Catch yourself, white works! Get me, make me some catch yourself bombs! You might be right. Listen. Okay, liquid form, aerial dispersal, we get low altitude ships coming in to drop the bombs, and who the fuck shot it? 
Way on you little shit! Are you insane? We had a dialogue! I fucking hate your ass! I am glad on this character I let Farrick live just because I know it'll piss you off! I'm relieved to see you well. It's fortunate we arrived when we did. A moment later, and that creature would have attacked the Founder. It was completely and utterly utter control, Wayun. Odo wasn't in any danger, Wayun. That Herc was peaceful. It was trying to communicate with us. That's your opinion. Mine is that a Founder was in danger of being attacked by a member of an aggressive species. My duty was clear, as is my conscience. We're wasting time here, Captain. The station is on the verge of being overrun by the Herc. If you want to communicate with them some more, you're free to do so, but I recommend we leave. Immediately. No! We make a fucking stand here. You have some catcher cell in that ship, don't you? Bring it down. We make... We make a fucking bomb out of it. When they come into the room, we blast them all with the catcher cell white. Fuck leaving! We have a shot! If that thing was full of catcher cell, there's probably more in these. We can weaponize it and then communicate! You little shit! I'm gonna kill you! Wait, is this open now? Yeah, now it's open. Okay. Fucking way you bullshit. I live to piss you off, Orda! Wait, that's a Herc lure. Wait, where? What? Why would the Dominion put one of those here? Maybe Wayun is tying up loose ends for the Founder. Oh. And risk the life of another Founder? Ridiculous! I think the Founder's capable of anything. Even killing one of her own. There are two lures in here. Hi, Luna. With me today is the little demon noodle, Luna. Yeah, hi. Hi, little demon noodle. Oh, the Herc and the Fakiri are... Oh, no, as soon as I opened the door, they all wanted to kill me. As soon as I went through the door. Great. Alright, open fire, just kill everything. Getting Gamma Quadrant reputation marks is gonna be fucking difficult, that's for certain. Then I have to do other things that'll give me marks, like those red alerts or something. Because the Gamma Quadrant Battle Zone again sucks. It just, it's just not made for actually getting marks. I don't know why they did it like that. And kind of annoying. Considering the fact that their reputation armor works best when your entire party is wearing it. Hey, look, uh, when we get out of this, I'll show you what I mean. Or oh, actually, wait, yeah, I can show you what I mean. I ha I'm, Once we I'm return to the upper levels, we will be able to beam up and leave this place. Are you ready to return? Yes, let's get out of here before the bugs try to kill us. Glad let's you could it. join us. As you can see, the situation here has become rather combustible. The Herc, I recognize, of course, but our other opponents remain a mystery. Some new type of Dominion attack craft, perhaps? Uh, Fakiri. We'll explain later. Just start shooting. Fakiri? As in the demonic beasts of Klingon folklore? Hmm. I'm intrigued. It's not every day one encounters mythic creatures. Unfortunately, Luna loves poking the television screen and shutting off my PS4, so she needs to leave. Now for our ball. I remember Mr. Worf mentioning the Fakiri. Beginning to see why. Hey, I've never seen that dreadnought before. I've only seen the small stuff. Cool. Hey, Dominion builds things to last. 
And whatever they're using, it doesn't count as a tractor beam. Polarizing hull, don't do shit. Then you can actually get a coffee battle cruiser for carrier for free. I plan on making another um wing on character, just KDF character, just to, to have that ship as my main. It's got two tactical, two science, and engineer, and a, I think it's just an engineer. It's an engineer in the universe. I don't remember. I can't remember this kind of off the top of my head, but it's. it's it's cool. It just looks, it has the look, it like has the fumes coming out while it's moving and shit, it is great. And you don't have to spend actual cash on it. Unless you've already picked something for your new ship, then, then you have to spend cash on it. Unlike the other ships where it switches to the lithium, I'm pretty sure in this one it just switches back to uh, Zen Coins. Zen Coins on the Sea Store. Alright, let's move in. Uh, I think it's been a while since I've leveled. Shame. I really want to get Temporal Operative instead of Intelligence, because the Intelligence is just a pain in the ass. It doesn't have much benefits that Temporal Operative does. I like the Temporal Operative, but they already pre-allocated all my fucking specialization points. Target shield have failed. Damar, wait, isn't that the guy who led the Rebellion? Oh, I guess he got his own ship class, huh? Wow, swanky. Reading a massive Herc fleet dropping out of warp. Okay, maybe we get out of here. Just as the Fakiri are warping up. I guess they're best buddies now. Great. Looks like the Fakiri are pursuing the better part of Valor. Yeah, blame them. There's a lot of Herc out there. Yeah. That was a strange revelation. We've learned we weren't the first soldiers of the Founders, but the first that did not fail. And some of their other attempts remain insane and wild, like rabid animals. I have seen what happens to Jemadar without Ketracel White. How far are we from becoming like the Fakiri? How far are we from madness? And who will follow us when we fall from grace? Uh, that will not happen as long as we stay drug addicts. Perhaps. There is a saying. It is the hope of all parents that their children will surpass them. As children of the Founders, we can never aspire to be gods. But perhaps someday we can be more than our creators imagined. More than just warriors. We're made in factories. We're literally genetically programmed not to have genders or reproductive the organs. Seem to be there ain't much we can do Something here. about the station that's holding their attention. We might be able to take advantage of it. We know this. it's taking advantage of it. Oh, we know what's distracting them. There's a lure see, on the you're side. We, attack. we should leave. Well, it's true. We have the advantage for now. I don't think we'll hold it for long once we start blowing them apart. We have what we came for. If the Herc want to gnaw on an asteroid while we make a hasty exit, I believe we should let them enjoy their meal in peace. Very well. We'll deal with the Herc later. For now, let's get back so we can analyze you are wasting the time. data we, we should leave. here. Hey, you're Whenever interrupting you're the Founder. Uh, that's just the part system before he keeps blabbering on about, You should leave! You need to leave! Get the fuck out! You know, he's gonna pull a gun and shooting at us until we go.
Yeah, right. Our findings today are disturbing. The Fakiri. They were our predecessors. Somehow they rebelled against the founders and freed themselves from the white. Though it seems to have driven them mad in the process. Something was happening with that strange Herc as well. It may have been trying to communicate. Perhaps it wanted to surrender. We'll never know. Devorta made sure of that. Typical. One thing is certain. The Founders won't forget the act of defiance from the Alliance here today. You and I both know their retribution can be sudden and severe. Be on guard. Our uneasy peace with the Alliance could collapse all too soon. Uh, I think you're taking it lightly. You mean more like fall like a fucking ton of bricks! Uh, wait, uh, how much time we got left? Oh, we have plenty! Uh, first let me do what I mean about the reputation here. Okay, because I think this was pretty much- I, I'm actually convinced this is fucking deliberate. Wait, what am I doing? Gamma reputation. Here we go. Magic shield. Eh, uh, not that. That is a shield. Now, <clears throat> When you have the full set, you get two team in self, plus 10% all weapon damage, and plus 10 kinetic and physical damage resistance rating. And then stun, and then the set three, when you have three of them, stun and damage targets in the terrain and area. It's a team in self, stacks teammates, 10 energy damage resistance rating, plus 5% maximum hit points, plus 5% maximum shield capacity. So if your entire team of five has that, I think you know where I'm going with this. In other words, you want as much of this stuff as possible, equip your entire team, and you have 25% more health, 25% more max health, 25% more max shields, and about 50 damage resistance rating. And this one stealths you for seven seconds when your shield drops below ten percent. <laughs> so it's good if you have the entire squad rolling in it. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure creating a battle zone where that was as hard as possible to get fucking marks from was pretty intentional. Anyway, let's, uh, just do the next mission now. Well, we have time. Uh, yeah, search, doom to repeat, and Quark's Lucky 7. My apologies for the quality of the transmission. I'm contacting you on an encrypted frequency. I'm working on an important covert mission, and I could use your assistance. I can't go into the details over comps, but you should know, if we pull this off, it could change the course of the Herc conflict in our favor. Meet with me on Deep Space Nine to go over the details. Come along. I've been asked to keep the details of the mission on a need-to-know basis, and right now, only you and I need to know. Except... Yay, we get to go hang out with Nog. Quark's Lucky 7. Wait, what's it? Wait, what are the rewards of this? Okay, yeah, I took the knife. And we are at the end of the Gamma Quadrant, so I may as well just transwarp. No, not that button. Rish button. For her, I have four million energy credits. Transwarp means nothing to me. Ow. Little demon noodle. No stabby. No, no stabby demon noodle. The demon noodle's name is Luna. She is the black kitten with the white chest. And we begin Quark's Lucky Seven. More like Ocean's Quark. Ocean Ferengi. 
One of these guys' name is secretly Danny Ocean. I think that was enough of a hint at what's about to happen. No. Absolutely not. This is your worst idea yet. Do I need to remind you of the unwritten rule of acquisition, brother? Rule zero. What the Nagus wants, we acquire. Why me? Get an Eliminator to do it. Get 50. You can afford it. You have connections with the Klingons. That and you're Rom's second most trusted Ferengi. What? Who's first? Nog? Pell? No. Boogie. Fine. Send her then. But brother, you did such a great job of rescuing her before. I also told your son to shoot me if I ever thought of doing something like that again. That's right, you did. Well, don't worry, he won't. That's not what I'm worried about. We need this, brother. We can't hold off the Herc forever. Alliance forces are spread too thin to help, Quark. We need the Klingons, brother. Otherwise, we're doomed. Insanity! You don't even know where the Iconian fleet is, Rom. I don't, but Starfleet Intelligence monitors all major threats, including the Iconians. Starfleet isn't in the habit of sharing classified data. If we can get access to a security console, we can extract the data. We'll need to keep the security officer on duty occupied. <laughs> Leave that to me, husband. Fucking oceans for Angie over here. I'm not even kidding. That's essentially what this is at this point. Either that or mission for Angie. All right, Lita. The security officer on duty is a creature of habit. Comes in on her break every day without fail. Your job is to keep her occupied so Rom can get what we need from the security console. Do what you need to do. Smile. Laugh at her jokes, whatever it takes. Put those feminine wiles of yours to good use. Really, Quark? I'm not here to seduce your customers. You and I both know there's more than one way to work a mark. Whatever you say, just don't mess it up. She'll be here any minute now. You worry too much, Quark. I got this. Camrangles! Woo! It's your lucky day, officer. You're the 10 millionth customer here at Quark's. Congratulations! You've just won a free drink and a free spin at the Davo table. Quark, why don't you pour the lucky winner a drink? What'll it be, Constable? Oh, thanks. I'll take a nice drag to Gino. Uh, I'm on duty. I can't stay too long, but I suppose I have enough time for a spin at the table. Lead the way. Camera! Why? Quark, will you turn that hollow me off, please? It's creeping me out. This is why I like the hollow leader. She doesn't complain as much as the original. There. Happy? Very! The free drink will get her to relax. And then some Dabo to keep her busy. One loss to remove suspicion. Oh, looks like my luck's run out. Oh well. Thanks for the drink and the spin. Better get back to my station. Whoa, whoa, whoa. don't be so hasty, friend. The law of averages is on your side here. Trust me. Have another spin on the house. What have you got to lose? Okay, you've convinced me. One more spin. Why not? Doo -doo -doo. And then a victory to reel her in. <gasps> Double! Nicely done. Uh, those winnings are coming out of your cut, though. Good. The guard's distracted. Time to go to work. Overriding this door panel should be child's play. You'll never find it. It's Mission Ferengi, not Ocean's Ferengi. 
<laughs> Mission Oceans for Ringy. This is the most secret there. maintenance panel. Chief O'Brien needed me to fix it once. Where is the damn thing? Okay, there it is. Uh, blue. See, this puzzle isn't exactly. Once I'm in, I can install a back door. It's not hard puzzle. And it's we just can that it's the bugs out. from the console at Quarks. So you can't actually see the rows change sometimes. Uh, how does this work? Lines and sequence and test it. Digits and locations, two. Mesh digits, one. Location, one. Okay, so three of these are right. Okay, so there's a one in here somewhere. But this one's wrong. And the only number that isn't here is this. Uh. So, let me change 4 for 1, see what happens. Oh, there we go. She's heading back, Yay! Mom. Get out of there! Run, run, run. Wait, why do you have my fucking rifle? Relax, everyone. It's done. I'm on my way back. Try not to look conspicuous or guilty. Yeah, Ramen's is the okay. best of this stuff. Why do you sound disappointed? Okay, who is this Zarit person that keeps saying stupid sexy me? So I can punch them. Can't believe you pulled that off. Being the Nagus hasn't made you go soft between the ropes. Let's figure this out before security gets wise. Use the console behind the bar and find out what you can about the Iconians. Oh, and while you're at it, look for any other useful information in there, too. Some of it could be valuable, you know. Relax, brother. I'll have these files cracked in no time. Starfleet encryption is good, but it's nothing compared to what we use in the Commerce Authority. That's actually difficult. And, by the way, they can't sprint. At all. Alright, so uh, everything but the Iconians. First. Intelligence officers log Stardate 87961.3. Intermittent Borg activity in the quadrant. We've been able to track a Unimatrix vessel, and our countermeasures are keeping its fleet at bay. The recent escalation of the Herc conflict is straining the number of resources available for Borg surveillance. Intelligence officers log start at 87983.1. Breen forces continue to harass the Teferi, though hostilities have not intensified as of late. The Breen have made no overtures toward the Dominion since their recent return to the Alpha Quadrant. Looks like the honeymoon might be over at last. Intelligence officers log start at 88139.9. A large Vakiri fleet has been spotted in transit to the Gamma Quadrant. Analysis of their course suggests they're heading toward the renegade Iconian fleet. Interesting. If the two of them manage to eliminate each other, well, that'll be two less headaches to keep me up at night. Intelligence officers log, Stardate 89001.7. Major Herc activity throughout the four quadrants. As expected, Alliance forces are spread thin in attempts to protect critical sites in their own territory, as well as within the Dominion. The Klingons continue to stay out of it, with the exception of a token force of volunteers. F-1 
efforts to enlist the full aid of the Empire to date have faltered. Intelligence officer's log start date 87997.9. I can't help but be impressed by the Nakul. Their star is all but dead, their world's an ice ball, and they refuse to leave. They defend that ice ball against all comers, even the Herc. Every Nakul big enough to carry a phaser fought, and they actually won. And I thought Tellarites were stubborn. Intelligence officer's log, Stardate 88006.2. There have been some recent Terran incursions from the Badlands, but nothing overly organized. As of now, there hasn't been any sight of Admiral Lita since her attack on DS9. Perhaps she has finally given up? <laughs> One can only hope. Intelligence officer's log, Stardate 89101.1. Tholian web technology has worked well against the Herc so far. They ensnared 70% of a Herc fleet shortly after it dropped out of warp. The rest of the fight was brief and one-sided. At least Tholian xenophobia is consistent. Our attempts to negotiate for web technology have been completely ignored. Intelligence officer's log started 89001.7. Getting a lot of disturbing reports from Zen Kathy Space lately. Whispers of corruption in the highest ranks, and talks of a coup are in the air on Zenkath. The Autarch's days might be numbered after his crusade failed, though the arrival of the Herc has kept him on the throne. For now. Intelligence officer's log started 88039.8. Taket's fleet is currently in the Feban sector, moving through deep space. She's keeping a low profile for the most part, avoiding conflict with both the Dominion and the Herc. Anything foolish enough to get in her sights doesn't live long enough to regret it, however. The wreckage of a Gamma Pirate Flotilla will testify to that. That's all the info I needed. And, uh, I, since I already did this, you didn't see it, but you actually get an accolade for reading everything. Or clicking on everything. Alright, Rom, a deal is a deal. You found the Iconian, so I guess it's my turn now. Time to put the team together? Uh, well, this is as good a spot to end it as any. A bit early, I know, but we won't get through. Uh, we won't get through the mission with the time we have left. So there's no point continuing right now. Don't want to cut in the middle of a good part, you know. So we're gonna end it here. Thank you for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe if you like. Want to come subscribe? And remember to follow me on Twitter for ch uh, channel updates pictures of dogs and cats and whatever else I decide to put up there. And next time on Star Trek Online Dominion Let's Play, we're going to be doing something stupid. Bye humans and non-humans alike and good ever applies to you.